When Harmonix began, we had a clear goal that we wanted to make games that were A, different from other games, um, and B, we wanted to focus on music. We all had a love for music, and pretty much everyone on the team at that point was a musician. We started learning our lessons. We realized that to make games that are popular and accessible and fun, um, you have to have characters. When Guitar Hero came up, um, we were basically just extending that notion. We had no idea that it would become so huge. And Rock Band is, is sort of the fulfillment of the grand vision of, of what we've been trying to do as a company, really, since the very beginning. And Rock Band has sort of been the culmination of all the experiences that we've come across in the past. So we've brought in singing, guitar playing, bass playing, and now this sort of new one for us is, is drum playing. Harmonix uses 3DS Max exclusively. That's our 3D modeling uh, package. We do use Max for our venues and for our characters. We also use it for our game shell. We're able to do a lot of the motion graphics stuff that you see using Max. For all our disciplines, there's a concept stage where you're either sketching down ideas or coming up with um, different themes for what you want to go after. And then you move into the actual production where you're building things, texturing, making them look awesome. When we're mocking up the venues um, and laying out the UVs and, and applying the textures, it's important for us to be able to see what we're doing and, and sort of like line everything up. So we will preview everything uh, in Max to get an idea of how the normals are looking and, and the basic layout of everything. We treat our implementation software uh, for the game and Max is interchangeable. So we use Max to sort of generate all the content, all the maps, applying the maps, UVing everything, and then test it out in the game to see how it comes out and looks. Well, being a character artist, I like to think that the characters are a big draw to the game. I work from the concept phase up. Initially, we would go into base modeling, then high-res modeling. Max is great for this because there's still a lot of back and forth even once we bring the high-res in. For instance, I had this one torso piece. It had horns on the side, and there was a lot of clipping. So. Uh, I was able to tweak the low poly in Max and the high poly projection would still hold up very nicely. We've experimented over the years uh, on techniques to make sure that our characters are doing things in time with the music and the game. You want face animation, lip sync animation, body animation, finger animation, kind of everything to match the music. If it's off even a little bit, it feels inauthentic. We need to know that we have a tool that's flexible enough to move that motion across different body types. And we'll use Motion Builder to retain a, a level of quality and the kind of flexibility that Motion Builder uh, brings along. We put a ton of work into the character creator. There are tons of different choices that you have with different fashions that you can use for your character, not to mention the fact that you can tweak out the dimensions of your character to be heavy or skinny. And we're tweaking all the character pieces in 3DS Max so that they're airtight, so that you can have a 3D print made. And it's colored the way that you set up your colors and everything. You know, your character and your band, your band logo, all these things that you can customize about your band, you can actually then get as physical objects. That's just like one little gift idea for those of you looking for that. The evolution of Harmonix has been really interesting. Uh, we've been many different kinds of companies over the past decade, but one thing that's really important to us is that we want to make sure that our games never become mundane. And the, the most important thing you can do there is have good people around. I mean, really, Harmonix is like a band. We each have our individual talents. We each have the things that we're doing to contribute. And all of Harmonix together, just like a rock band, is, is creating this one final product.